Hey everyone, in this video we will learn how to do simple and complex queries in Firebase Firestore. In the previous video we have learned how to sort and limit the data using order by and limit function. We used the query function and the queries can be used with any kind of get function or the snapshot listener function that we have already used. Executing a query is pretty simple. You just need to pass the collection reference and then you need to use this where function to add a condition. So let's see how we can use it. I will comment this previous query. I'll create a new query. So I want to get a document which title is the benefits of meditation. So I can call the query function, then pass collection ref, and I can use the where function. And the condition would be title. The second argument is going to be the operator that you want to use, like greater than sign, equal sign, not equal sign, then you have in operator, array contains array, any, and so on. So I want to use the equals equals operator, and the title should be the benefits of meditation. And after that, you need to pass the query variable to the get docs function. That should be it. And now we have the document that matches our condition. I can also use query for the date fields. So I want to get all the documents that is posted before January 29th. So the logic should be something like this. So we have created our new date object and then we have converted into our timestamp. And this should return all the documents that matches with this condition. So we have all this post that is posted before January 29th. You can also reverse the condition. I want everything after January 29th. Now all the post is after January 29th. Then you also have array operators. So I want to use the text field now. And I will use the array contains operator. And I want to get all the documents that has the tag of meditation. So these two documents contains meditation in the tags field. Then you also have Eric contains any. So this will include all the documents where the tags has either health or fitness as an element. So these are all the documents which has either fitness or a health tag. And then you have in operator. So now we want to get where the title is either the benefits of meditation or the benefits of yoga. So we have this benefits of meditation, but we don't have any post that is the benefits of yoga. You can also use not in operator. Now it will give you all the documents that is not the benefits of meditation. Now these were actually simple queries. You can also do compound queries using AND or OR logic. So compound queries is pretty easy. You can use the AND logic by passing multiple WHERE function. So for example, I want all the documents that were created before January 29th and the document that contains the meditation tag. And it is telling us that this query requires an index and we can create it by using this link. So you don't have to do anything. Now we can just click on save. And it is building the index for us. So we need to wait. All right, the index is created. Now if I refresh the page, we shouldn't see the error. And now we have only one document that matches with our condition. And these two are using AND logic. I can prove that by committing up one WHERE function. And now we have two results. Both of them has the meditation tag. And the second one is, and the second document is actually posted after January 29th. You can also use the AND function. So I will also comment this out. So I can use the AND function. And here I can also pass multiple where function call. So I will copy this. And also copy this logic. Again, we have the same result. 
you can also use the R function for the logic. So let me comment this out. So now we are trying to get all the documents before January 29th and the document that has the meditation tag and we only have this documents. So the R logic is also working. We can also combine and or logic and it should look something like this. So basically here we want to get all the documents before January 29th and the title has to be either the benefits of meditation or the importance of sleep. So let's run the query and it is telling us to create another index. So we will create one. So let's hit save and let's wait for it to build. All right, so the index is created. So let's go back to our localhost and we don't have any documents probably no documents matching with our conditions so let's change the condition let's change the month okay so we have one document that is posted before february 29th and the title is the importance of sleep so this is how you can create simple and compound queries there is a lot of things that you can learn more about from the documentation and that's it. That's it for the video series. If you have watched the entire video series, thank you very much. I really appreciate that. If the video or the video series has been helpful for you, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. And also let me know in the comments what type of content you want to see next. If you have any questions, feel free to comment out. I will try my best to answer them. You can also follow me on LinkedIn or Twitter as Saranjan. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye. Oh,